And now I'd like to give an overview of the typical machine learning development process at Lincoln. The first stage is idea. The machine lear learning engineer will have an idea of how to, how to improve the product. This is typically tied to the business logic of the product. For example, uh, an engineer might be having a, an idea of using a deep learning model to extract useful information from a job post to improve the accuracy of job recommendation. And then the next stage is research. For any given idea, there must be existing solutions in the community. So in this case, the engineer would do research and find out the machine learning measure that can be used to do this type of natural language processing, for example, BERT. And the next stage is opportunity analysis. The engineer needs to do a preliminary analysis to see the scope of uh, applicable area for this method. If this particular method can only be applied, for example, to a small portion of job posting, then the opportunity is limited. If the opportunity is verified, we enter the expensive phase of offline experiment. For offline experiment, the machine learning engineer needs to provide an implementation of different, uh, different methods. For example, the machine learning engineer needs to build a data pipeline to generate the features, the labels, and need to provide an implementation for the machine learning model and algorithms. The model is a format and the algorithm specifies how to update the parameters of the model over input data. And then the machine learning training needs to be repeated many, many times with different configurations, including hyperparameters. And this process is highly iterative. And then we have the offline evaluation based, uh, to evaluate the model based on past, uh, a, a past a few days or few weeks of offline data. If the offline evaluation turns out to improve metrics, then we can go to the online deployment process of pr productionalize the, data, the model, verify the model, deploy a model, and do online A-B tests gradu gradually uh, ramp up to uh, majority member experience. If it turns out to improve online metrics, then we call it a success. Otherwise, we turn to the beginning. <laughs> 